shooter in the school, shots have been fired, we don't know any other details, where do we start? Today, when discussing active shooter scenarios, we did a tabletop. We brought in all the interested parties uh, from the school district, public works, fire, EMS, police, uh, so that we could all have a roundtable discussion on how we believe it would be best appropriate for us to respond to one of these situations. That way it gets the decision makers all at one table. It allows us to then actually hear it from the proverbial horse's mouth, mouth as it were. Uh, so that we can then see what issues might arise and then address them better down the road. It was a good exercise. Uh, we got some good information going. We understand how these things have to operate now, and we understand who has the capability of doing the critical uh, functions that are going to take place. Uh, anytime you can sit down and connect with the major players behind a hypersensitive issue such as school safety, it's a good day for all of us to get together and know each other and have conversations about each other's role and responsibility and what we can bring to the table. Well, on an incident this size, we can't do it all by ourselves, so we need help. And whenever you invite other people in, you have other standard procedures that have to be absorbed. And so if we can all get together on the same procedures and the same planning, then we'll, we'll do things much better than if we tried to do it without.